help me love the life I have right now. Show me the good things I often overlook and help me be content with you and what I have. Forgive me for when I compare myself to others. Forgive me for me judging others. Forgive me for me backsliding and forgive me for all I have done. And forgive me for longing the things outside of you and your kingdom. I thank you for loving me. I thank you for protecting me. I thank you for having your hand on me. And I thank you for blessing me for all what you have blessed. And I thank you for protecting everyone out there as well. And help us all to keep our eyes on you. And to further praise you. I ask you this in Jesus Yeshua's name. Amen. How you guys doing today? I got you guys right here right now because uh, I got a, another subscriber who saw my photographs on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. and He shared some photographs with me. And what I'm going to share with you guys right now too is, I don't know if you guys are going to want to believe it or not, but just like a Jupiter-like Jupiter -like object in back of the sun right now. And it's, uh, uh, how you say that? It uh, has two moons traveling with it. It's just weird, guys. Well, before we get on, let me show you guys this right here. This guy's photographs right there. Then I'll show you guys. This is what he got. This guy's out there in Spain. Shout out, Luis. He's out there in Spain. See the objects that he's capturing out there. It is almost like the way Atlanta and I myself are capturing them. That right there, I don't believe it had anything. Or if it did, he he didn't mark it. I'm looking around, but I really don't see anything here. I looked around this whole thing. But then you got that one jumping up up there. Then you got this little one. Then again, I said... I think he sent me. I think it's that right there? No. Then he sent me this one right there. Yeah, it's that. Then that one. That one. These two are not the same. That object moved, and so did that. He's got it right here, there. See this little one? That one, that one. And we're back right here in the beginning, guys. I want you to give a shout out to Luis. He's out there in Spain. Now, what you guys are about to see right now. You guys see this little object right here by the, by the sun? Yeah, that's an object right there by the sun. It's not a lens first, guys. I'm going to blow this up right here, push it up. You see how it moves right there in the back? Right there? Yeah, that's your that's your object. You see the stripes already? This is a moon right there. That's a moon. We're going to show you guys right now in the video right now. Watch. Matter of fact, let me show you guys the rest of the, these photographs so we can move on and then show you the video and then show you the other photographs. Here we go. These are the two objects that are there too. See that object, that object? In the video we caught today. Right there. These two. Then that one right there you can barely make out, but there's one right there. But these two are hanging a little bit right there by the sun. Then they become one. Yeah, there's a lot of that one right there. And then it's, this is where it starts becoming uh, where. Uh, is there anything else? No, I don't see it. Then you have that one right there. back there yeah what I did I think I took I think I copied a couple of them I think I even copied one photograph I shouldn't have yeah, an object right there one right there Oh, this little one right there. 
Oh yeah, this is when it starts getting right here. Starts doing the big, the close-ups. There in the VSL. I was doing the VSL zoom. Here's your object right there. See it? Now you go right there. Now you see it right there. Got one moon right there and another moon. And here's the thing. Here's your stripes. You see the stripes already on it, like a rainbow stripe object. You guys are gonna see that in, in the video right now. Watch. And you got this. See that object? All these right there. Same thing. See that? And here's that one right there that looks like a moon. I told you guys that one right there that Atlanta caught. Got a half moon that one day. Now here's a full moon. It's like a moon like object. See that? Pretty awesome, huh, guys? Pretty. This is, this is so cool. But scary at the same time. I said that one day, someone that someone uh, comment saying, "Why am I uh, so so excited about the doomsday?" I said, "I'm not excited about the doomsday. It's just this is an exciting time to be living in." Oh yeah, this big object right here. It's in the back of the sun. You can see this move watch. See it right there. Back. See it. Ah. Sorry guys. See that right there. And now you got that one. That one that went up there. And we're back right here to end uh, I just wanted to get more better close ups to see if I was actually seeing what I was seeing. Then you got this one right there. See it? Like an egg shape, oval shape. A little moon right there or something with it. You got that one right there. See that? Those two. Yeah. Got that right there. I should have zoomed in and made these a little bit bigger. But I did and I just wanted to see what was going on right here. Show you guys that video right now, and then I'll show you guys the whole uh, the whole photograph selection. I'm trying to figure out what was right here, what was so significant in me taking a photograph right here. I don't know. Oh, that object too, right there. Look at. Another one. The object right there in the bottom. Oh yeah, it's cropped. Wings coming out that way. Oops. And we're done right here, guys. Yeah. Now let's go with Atlanta's photographs. Sorry, guys. I was supposed to show up. Uh, I was supposed to be doing that. It's supposed to be letting me see this view. But it's been acting this way with me. Don't know why. 
for quite some time. Then after that, it'll say it's not responding, then it'll turn white, and then it'll either show up for me to preview or it'll stop. That's why I don't like using, there we go. He's on the 23rd and we're on the 24th. So what Atlanta got right there. See, it's almost the same things. See that big object like I showed you guys? So yeah. That's right there. Look at that. Was. Flare right there. See? Flare. That's the object there. Oh, show me some debris. That's right. He said there's a one, about one or two photographs that show some debris for me to show this very carefully, very wisely for me to blow this up very, very big so you guys can see this. Yeah, I'm starting to see what he means. Yeah, you can see the debris. There's an object right there. Some of these barely you can make out when they come in. Like I said, they, some of these blend. Is this some of this debris? Oh, just to let you guys, some of you guys know, I talked to Paula Gilly. I had a message her. She said she's okay, but she's waiting for her. her uh, you know, she's waiting for her to go to the doctor. For the doctor, I almost said what's going on. Who? Uh, she's waiting for a doctor, and the doctor's just neck. She's like, she's like 50%. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at them. Oh, my God. Look at that. Show you guys the photographs right now, and then I'll show you guys the video. The video will be last, so you guys can see. I know I promised you guys the, uh, the video. See? Once I saw that object, I was like, oh, yeah, that looks like the one on the video, right? And I was going to tell you guys if you guys remember seeing it, but you guys didn't see it because I didn't tell, show it to you guys. I promise. I'll just show you guys. I, I, I apologize. But I just got carried away over these photographs that I wanted to share with of Atlantis. The objects are here. This object's clo uh, closing in on us. Like it has some moons. And it's just crazy. Oh yeah, we're back right here in the beginning, right? Yeah. I think so. Yeah, look at that right there. It's like, it's like the what I'm going to show you guys what, what, what it passed by today. See that? See it right there? See it right there, and then that one right there. But you can see that one. You see it right now. See that? Look at that, guys. <laughs> oh, wow. That's like what Luis caught, too. And that was yesterday, that this was yesterday, and this one's the one he cut, and Luis cut it today. So that means this object is actually, is, it is coming in this way around us. It's coming this way around us, then. That's how it's circling around us. It's not circling, it's circling around this way, actually. It's not, okay. This is the sun, the way, okay, let's just say we orbit around this way, right? This way. 
this object's actually orbiting around this way around this. It's just put our so solar system sideways and, it's, and our solar system's coming, you know, sideways right at us. That's how the solar, the solar system is. Yeah, we're back right here in the beginning, guys. Okay, now let me show you guys the video. What you guys are seeing right here is that object, okay? Let me blow this all the way up so you guys can see that this object has two moons. Blow this up as much as you can. See, there's two moons. One, two. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to move this out the way. Okay? I'm going to blow this up down. Let this down go so you guys can actually see this object. Look. See this object come in play right now. Pay attention. I'll pause it. Then I'll play the mo I'll play the video so you guys can see how fast this object moves. And then you guys can tell me someone there it is like see it right there. I'll blow this up for you guys so you guys can see it again. I don't like when it does that. You can see that? We're gonna go again. See it get right there. See it? And then check this out. There it is right there. See it? See the two moons? One moon, two moons. I'm going to get a little close up on that right there. That's the most I could get in there. Because you guys see I'm already full zoom. See that object right there? See the stripes? One stripe, two stripes, three stripes right there. There's one moon, two moons. Let's go back a little bit more. And let's do that again. i leave it right here so we can see the object just pass by again. And then we'll blow it. And then I'll get out of zoom so you guys can see it. Yeah, here comes the object to be coming back right high right now. There it is. See that? Like a ball just coming back. See those two little moons. Look at that right there, guys. I tell you guys, I don't show you guys no lens flares or I don't show you this and that. I'm wanting to show you guys the truth, what's back there. There's something back there that's orbiting in back of the moon. I mean sun. This is a sun. So I can show you guys this is a sun. Okay, one oh eight. You guys can see it's our sun. See the sun right there? This is our sun. There. So now we go back to 108, about 108 right here. Then we go back again. We just play it. Pause it. Let the object come. There it is right there. See it? There's your object right there. Now let's get out of here right here again so you guys can see how small that is. That thing looks look at look at how small it looks right there. Let me get out of zoom right here so you guys can see this. And then I'll show you guys the rest of the other photographs and that's the end of the video. Okay. This is the object right there, okay? Let's get out of here. About right there. Let's play it so you guys can see it. Regular. See? See how fast it moved? One more time. So you guys can see it. One more time regular. Then we'll, and then I'll slow it down. Then here we go. See it? No. Let's go back a little bit and then I'll frame by frame so you guys can see it again one more time. There's your object right there. Look at it. Goes right there and back. Back at the sun. And boom. Gone. You guys seen how many moons it's traveling with them? Plus, only that. Let me go back again real quick so you guys can see something that I forgot to mention on this. I mentioned on this. Let's go right there. Let's blow this up real quick. Forgot to mention this. Sorry. Just excited. I don't like when it does this. Just for you guys to pay attention to it. Pay attention to the object. The object is sideways. It's on, it's, it's, it's on, you know, it's sideways. It's not like Jupiter, the way Jupiter is almost belly up. I mean, not belly up, you could say this is belly up if you want to put it that way. Jupiter's not. And look at the stripes on this one. This one's blue, brown, white, blue, brown, white. Has one moon, two moons. One moon, two moons. For right now, what you guys are seeing. Now, we're gonna get with the. No, not that one. 
Sorry guys, not even that one. Oh yeah, if you guys want to see some some crazy videos. Let me see. Here we go, let's see some other crazy videos. I just thought I'd share with these guys this too. Look at that object just sitting right there. Doing nothing. Having fun. See it right there? Let's go back a little bit right here so we can see some more. Let's get out of this. This colors. Look at that. See that? And we got another one right here. See that? I'll show you guys the actual, uh, the actual real video of this. The first one came from, uh, I believe it was Cuba, and the other, one, and this one right here came from uh, Washington. Okay, here's a here's a first, the other one. That, there's the one that came from Washington right now, and then I'll show you guys the one from Cuba. Here's that one right there. See it? This is the one from Cuba. I mean, I showed you guys this one, right? Yeah, I did. Sorry about that. This is the one right here. The, a zoom. A zoom in the one from Cuba. Look how big that thing is. Look at that. There you go. I'm just trying to mess around with any color, guys. Let's play it again. Let's get it right in the middle. Look at the way it looks. The outside of it. Look at that. When I saw that, I was like, wow. Look at this object, it just stays stationary. It's like a two minute video. But this object stays stationary there and then it starts traveling, I believe. There's some stars around us right now, some objects around us that are blinding up some of the inside of the clouds. So when they're in the clouds, it kind of looks like it's, there's like a big old sun or... I do believe there is, you know, light sources out there, I'm not going to lie. But some of the light sources are caused by some of these objects that are, tra are passing by. I got some videos that I want to share with you guys, so I'm going to do this tomorrow. 
Let's get out of that array. You guys saw that? Let's get this one right here. You guys can see this one. Then we'll go on with the other photographs. And that one right there. I love that this person ha has a, a tripod. You guys see that? Whatever it is, it got objects traveling with it because you can see the objects right there moving around with it, bouncing around right there. And it even has one in the middle of it. Watch. Let's take a look at it. See the one right there? Look, even that one right there is moving around with it, traveling, crawling around. Look at, look at this one right here. You can see one. Look at that one right there. It's crawling around it. It's like a bug crawling around it, going around it. Damn. See it right there? It's like a little bug crawling around it. And you got that one right there in the middle of it. And you have that one on top right there. Like on top right there. Boom, 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 boom. Whatever it is, it's orbiting with all kinds of debris. Could be the asteroid. Could be the asteroid, guys. Just thought I'd share that with you guys. And another... Uh, Yeah, to show you uh, Ohio's object right there. See the cloud? Cloud and there's an object in it. pretty good editing and then look at this other my needle my needle sphere is all out of whack right there right here the, the only best definition for me to give you right now is another way our magnetic sphere right here broke our my needle sphere this is another object attracting us uh, uh, attra uh, attracting to our my needle sphere in other words this is the other polarity of the other object this is our polarity mother earth already has hers right here and this is another object for this is coming from another object I have a video. There's a video I have right here. There's some guy who explains it way better. I'm gonna put that up on, on my channel so you guys could understand. And just I'm gonna start putting in these these photographs right in the middle of the, with that video, so you guys could see what I was talking about. Put some photographs at the same time when he's putting it in there. Have one of these vi videos play, so you guys could actually start seeing the object. Be like, oh, that's what it is right there. We're getting right because right here, this is the other object pulling on pulling on Earth right now. You see right there how it had a grip on Earth right there, and it has like it right there has a grip on it, grip on it, blow it up. You see that right there? Has a, has a grip on Earth, and this is your object right here, your object that's in the back right now that, that has a magneto, that's strong magneto sphere, strong strong one, and it's pulling on Earth already. Look at that, it's really breaking. So I told everybody there's all kinds of pressure in the back field of the Earth because you can feel it. I can feel it at night. That's why I can't sleep sometimes at night. Like I said, we're back right here. Then I got one more photo folder, but I'm trying to remember where it's at. I just don't want to show you guys. Uh... Oh, yeah, we're right here. Because I got to show you guys this one right here, too. See right here how it is right here? This is our main needle sphere right here. This is ours right here, right here okay? That's what we have right here. Now, this is where it starts getting, it's getting all warped. See how see how ours is bending out all the way out here. How this is right. This is where our sun's at and everything. You know, this is what if if it should be the way, it should be the opposite. This should be this 
being over here because our son's all the way out here putting all kinds of pressure. You know, has a has a magnet, and we have another magnet that's about as powerful as our sun, or I could say right now, is a little more powerful. Where our magnetosphere from our north and south is coming way out here, getting attracted. Now let's get on with some pho uh, photographs. Here's some photographs here. Then here's here. This is what I caught. Get some objects, guys. Then right here, remember that moon right there that Atlanta caught up there too. That moon. You got that right there. See, I'm sorry I go fast, guys. It's just it's already been a long video. See that? See where the object came back right there with the two moons? Here, look at that right there. See, we see this is a sideways. See it? Everything that right here is almost matched to a T where everyone caught. That huge one right there. Right there. We're back right here in the beginning. Yep. Let's look at that video one more time. Before I let you guys go so you guys can see this. Does that object go by? One more time. There it goes. There it goes. There it is. Here it comes. There it is. Blow it up one more time so you guys can take a look at it. Remember, object sideways on its belly. On its back right here, side. This is his front side. Here's his belly and here's his back or whatever you want to call it. His stomach, his back, don't matter. It's on its, its sideways and there's two moons right there. So then, guys, take care. I love you guys. I just wanted to share this with you guys. All right. God bless you guys. I love you guys. Take care. Bye.